Good morning guys, it's Lucy and today I am in Kichi Joji and we are on our way to the Studio Ghibli Museum. I don't have my new Suica holder which I got from WC which is just like a little Esther rabbit and as you can see it pops Suica in the back there so that's really handy because it's like a little keychain and it's elastic so I don't lose it because that's the kind of thing I would do. So anyway, now we're just walking through the park, there's Max in his big old coat. <laughs> no, stop dabbing. Made it to the museum. Um, there's a little bit of a queue waiting in, and like I said in my last vlog, I won't be filming inside the museum because you're not allowed to, and I'm gonna respect that. I'll be grabbing clips of some of the outside areas which you can film in, but any of the inside areas is a no go. Okay, we're just on the roof now, which is like one of the only places you can film in the museum. I mean, I thought I was gonna enjoy it. Um, but I'm really, really enjoying it. It's really, really amazing. We just saw the short film. They give you like little tickets like this, which are actually like little film strips of like a Ghibli film. And those are your tickets to see one of the short films that you can only see in the museum. So that was really special. We saw a really cute like spider one. I'm not gonna tell you anything about it. I mean, it's not really like spoilers, but <laughs> um, yeah, that was really special and that's something you can only do here. So I think that personally is like worth the price for admission alone. Really, really well done, like beautifully curated museum. It's really a shame. I mean, I kind of like the fact that I didn't get to film or take pictures because it let me just enjoy it, but um, it really is super beautiful and like well done in there, so it's really good. Hey guys, so we're currently lining up at Sato Meat Cutlets. Um, I saw this in an Eat Kimchi video, they were talking about how these are really amazing kind of like cutlets from, I believe it's like a steakhouse, um, so it's like kind of the extra bits that they put in like a little crumb cutlet and I thought this would be a good quick lunch. There's a line. I feel like everything here has a line, but that's okay because most of the time it's been really worth it. Um, so yeah, we're just going to grab a couple of those um, while we're here in Kichi Joji and then we're going to head somewhere else. Alrighty, so we just ate those meatballs really quickly because um, we were starving. So uh, unfortunately I don't have footage of that. We were just like really hungry. We were like driven rabid by the cold and the hunger. Um, but now we're actually in Nakano and we're going to Nakano Broadway which has some like anime stuff which could be cool we're going to some Sailor Moon merch but um, other than that just think we have a look around maybe see if we can spot those giant ice creams they've had about I don't know if we'll be able to do it but I sort of believe in ourselves we'll find out <laughs> alright guys it seems like we have found the ice cream place that's really famous for having the multi-layer ice cream. I believe it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 eight layers of ice cream, soft serve, and they're all different flavors, so we're gonna grab one and try it because you can't not, I feel. Oh my gosh, he's a big boy. Alrighty, we have decided that in order to walk off all of that sugary goodness, we are going to go to Harajuku, aka one of my favorite places in the world. I feel like people think that Harajuku may be overdone, but I don't know. I just, I can never get enough of it. And it never gets old to me. It's amazing. The first time I went there and I was like 13, I was like, this is the best place in the world. And you know what? It still kind of is. So we're going to do like a little bit of shopping, maybe grab some dinner. And yeah, just enjoy, enjoy the afternoon. Stopping for a quick coffee to refuel. They like started going down the street and we were like, oh, we tired. He did. Okay. <laughs> this place came up on Google as like a recommended spot. I actually think it's like a New Zealand or Australian cafe because it's very like Australian style kind of stuff. And they have New Zealand beers, Max is saying, so it's pretty good. I've got a chai latte, Max has a cold brew, because he's a he's a big boy who's not scared of caffeine. It's actually a nitrogen cold brew. Wow. wow. Impressive. Okay, uh just finished my latte. It was very good. We're now splitting up. I'm gonna go do some shopping in Harajuku. Max is gonna do some of the back streets and do a little bit of thrift shopping and stuff like that. Um, we tend not to both like the same brands. Like Max is not really a huge fan of Liz Lisa, which is fair enough, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go do some shopping. Hopefully it's efficient and I get some stuff that I want and uh, yeah, then I'm gonna reconvene for Dindins. I think 
I may have hit the jackpot. The anime boys I have found them. So we're going to try this thing and what I believe it is, is like a ticket lottery kind of dealio. So on here they have all the prices and it's about 620 yen. And what you do is you just buy the ticket and then you get to pick a ticket out of the box and see what you get. There are some really good items like a big lunar cushion, like little lunar pouches, even like the glasses are really cute. So I think I'm going to give it a go. Do it for the content, do it for you guys. This is my card. So I got the F ticket. These little plates. I got a plate. I didn't think I'd get a plate because everyone got the plates, but you know what? I'm actually happy with it because I'm gonna put some like earrings and stuff in here. That's cool. Yeah, sick. Guys, I'm here in downtown Tokyo. I think we're in a place called Harajuku, Help and me. we're about to have some gyoza. I feel attacked. They're like fried bits of meat in a little wrapping, and they're very scrumptious. So we are meeting up for dinner. We're going to a gyoza place. I don't actually know what the translation of it is, but it's this one. It seems to have good reviews. It was just in a couple guides, so thought we'd check it out. Um, but yeah. I am just gonna sit and have my latte and enjoy the view for a few minutes. Um, and that's pretty much all for tonight. Um, yeah, it's been a good day, it's been a fun day. Like lots of walking, so much walking. We walked like 20k today apparently, but uh, yeah, it's been a really, really fun day. Every day's been fun here, but I'm gushing. Anyway, um, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.